gifts that GW has that were the number one store in the nation for internships. So um, usually our swimmers and divers go through two or three internships during their time at GW. So it doesn't take that much persuading. Um, obviously we'd love to have them stay maybe more of the summers than, than just maybe the one or the two. But um, you know, it, it takes time. It, it, it takes time to develop the culture to, to kind of focus more on that year-round focus for us. And uh, um, I think the results are starting to show that a little bit. Yes and no. I mean, at the end of the day, I mean, we have to create an environment that's going to take care of most of the team and um, you know really take care of our sort of higher end athletes. At the end of the day, um, we got a nice blend of athletes, uh, international athletes that are trying to represent their country. Um, like Gustav has here last summer at World University Games, um, and we got some good domestic uh, U.S. kids as well that hopefully will be hitting trials. So, um, you know, we've been successful recruiting in both areas, so we try to cater to those, and at the same time, for those that are looking for you know, a great internship uh, environment as well, we make sure that they have the option to train or have practices and stuff too. So, um, you know, it's taking some time to, to progress the program and to change the culture away from where it was three years ago. But um, you know, one one year, one step at a time. You know, when I inherited the program, and when we had some smaller rosters on the men's and women's side, we were um, dead last on the women's side in the Atlantic 10 Conference, and the men were second to last in the Atlantic 10 Conference. It never won uh, the A10s. Now the men have won it two years in a row. Um, we haven't sent someone to NCAA's in a very long time. We've never had an All-American in the last two years. We've had All-Americans, um, so it's been definitely a. A huge change, that's for sure, in the sense of where we were three years ago. But at the same time, uh, you know, the, we got some great coaches here at GW. We got some really good student athletes that have bought in. We got a supportive uh, culture and a supportive administration. So it's really put us in a good position to improve as a program uh, in the classroom, in the pool, and in the community. Well, on the men's side, in three years, we've gone from a team that came seventh. My first year, we came fifth, and in the last two years, the men have won the Atlantic Ten Conference. Um, which is the first time that's ever happened in the conference. Uh, for us, now on the women's side, we started with 11th uh, four years ago. My first year, we were 9th. My second year, 7th. And then this year, we were 3rd. So, um, you know, very much building a championship program um, at our level, at the A10 level. Uh, you know, competing more at the national level as well. But, um, you know, also succeeding in the classroom too.